Good morning, you guys. What is up? Welcome back to my channel. Um, I just woke up. It's literally like fucking, it's 7.30 in the morning. So yeah, I just woke up. Um, I figured I would vlog today because like I said in my last video, I wanna start vlogging more. Um, so yeah, when I first wake up in the morning, I always have Kurt up my ass, meowing, wanting treats. So I'm gonna give this boy his food, his breakfast. I'm out of wet food. So I apologize, Kurt. I'm gonna have to go to Walmart and get some wet food for you. But yeah, um, y'all look at their little cat closet. So uh, this is like a random closet in my house and I made it to where I put like this rug in here, their litter box and all their food. So it's like really organized. And like whenever they need to go shit, they literally take their paw and just open the door and they go shit <laughs> and it's so funny. So it's really handy and like kind of perfect for them. Cause it like keeps the smell down from their shit. Look at this boy, he's so hungry. All right, Kurt, let me get your food. There's Callie, that bitch is crazy for real. What's up? Y'all look, <laughs> their bowls are empty. That's why they've been going crazy this morning. But yeah, you guys, I'm gonna go hop in the shower and get ready. Hopefully by the time I get out, my driveway is not completely snowed in and I can get out of here because like I said I need to go to Walmart so I'm gonna go get ready okay guys so I finally just got showered and ready um, I'm gonna go ahead and head to the store and get my groceries and stuff because it's still pouring the snow outside so I'm afraid if I don't go now then I won't be able to go at all and then I'll be stuck here with no fucking food so I'm gonna get that um, taken care of y'all look outside it's literally pouring the snow Kurt's like trying to get out and look at it you see the snow baby you see all the snow yeah y'all look here get back Look outside, you guys, it's literally wide. Like I said, I'm gonna go to the store before it gets any worse and I can't go at all. Um, Cause I drive a bug and they're definitely not made for the fucking snow. So I'm gonna take care of that. I'm gonna show y'all my outfit really quickly before I do go though. So I have on this um, sweatshirt from ASOS. It's like a blue knit material. It's really comfy. I wear it all the time cause I really like the color with my hair. So I have this on with like a button up underneath it. I have on these pants from American Tall. Um, I'm really fucking tall. I'm 6'6", six, six, so I have to wear like special pants. So I also have on these uh, Converse One Stars. Pretty basic, simple fit, um, but clean. So, yeah. Also, I was washing my tat, and even more of like the scabbing fell off, so it just keeps looking better and better. So, hell fucking yeah. my car there's so much snow <laughs> holy shit i can't even see up my windows barely this shit is crazy all right you guys so um <laughs> literally it's been like four minutes if that since i left my house and i literally just slid off the fucking road into a fucking ditch and it's not even a fucking ditch it's like a fucking it is a ditch it's a ditch full of like fucking mud and water and shit so i'm literally sitting here off the fucking side of the road, y'all, in a fucking ditch of water. Like, my car, like, literally, it was the scariest thing ever. I've never been in a car wreck, and, like, y'all, <laughs> I like, it's a sharp curve, and, like, I was going kind of slow, like, I wasn't going fast at all, and, um, before I knew it, my car was spinning, and, like, I was all the way up the road with, like, my foot all the way down the brakes, and, like, I just slid all the way down the road, so, like, I knew it was coming, and I knew there was a big-ass, like, ditch here, so, like, I literally flew off of it, and my car is, like, this fucking in mud. Like, I saw this mud go everywhere. So, holy fucking shit. I'm not going out of the car yet. I'm just sitting here. I don't want to get out because I'm kind of embarrassed because, like, I don't want anyone to drive by and see me, like, sitting here like a dumbass with my car <laughs> in the fucking ditch. And, like, literally before I left to go to Walmart, you guys, I was talking to my dad on the phone and he was like, are you sure you should go? Um, you might wreck because it's pretty fucking snowy outside. You might want to just wait and I can come take you to Walmart later. And I was like, no, I can fucking do this. And, uh, yeah, now I'm in a fucking ditch. So, today's off to a great start, y'all. Um, but you know what? At least we have some vlog content. So, maybe I'll just get out and show y'all what I look like right now. Because my car, hopefully my car's not fucked up. Oh, my God. What if my car's fucked up, y'all? Y'all, I'm literally in these people's, like, backyard in their ditch. I hope they don't come outside because that'll be really embarrassing. Let me get out. This is mad embarrassing, y'all. Holy fuck. I called the towing company and they're on their way. So they're gonna come pull me out of here. <laughs> Holy fuck, y'all. My car is actually in water. All right, y'all. So like, there's the road. I slid down and I went all the way off this fucking ditch. So there's my fucking car. <laughs> y'all, this may actually be worse than I thought because this was like a pretty steep ditch and my car literally like slammed into the mud. And I can't go over there to check on it because it's like all in the water. 
So I guess I won't know if my car's okay till they pull it out. So this is so fucked. This is embarrassing as fuck too. It's like really snowy and fucking cold. And these people should be here in like 10 minutes, they said. So I'm just waiting on them. Oh uh, yeah, this is mad embarrassing. I called my dad too and he's like pissed. <laughs> he's like, I fucking told you. So here we are on the side of the road. Hella embarrassing. All right, y'all, so I'm just gonna chill in my car until I see the towing truck. Cause I don't want every single person to come by to like stop and ask me if I'm okay. And it's like, bitch, my car is in a ditch. <laughs> Does it look like I'm okay? <laughs> Yo, I guarantee the whole front left side of my car is just like fucked. All right, you guys, update. So, uh, it has been a crazy fucking day. It is like, what time is it? It's three o'clock now. So I wrecked this morning around 10, 20 in the morning. So, uh, yeah, it's like much later. Uh, I've been with my dad all day. I'm in my dad's truck right now. He's currently in this auto body shop, um, talking to the people to see if I can get my car worked on this week. So I'm basically not going to have a car for the next two or three days because we're going to have to work on it. Cause when I wrecked, uh, it fucked up my radiator and it's like leaking, like, fluids and shit i'm not really a car person so i don't really know what the fuck's going on but apparently my radiator's fucked up and i'm not gonna be able to have a car for like three days now so <laughs> yeah it, it sucks but it could be a lot worse um like honestly i thought my car was gonna be way worse my dad cut like the front bumper off where it fucked it up and um yeah like when i went off that road you guys it was super intense like I don't know if you guys saw, but like I went off a basically a ditch and it was a pretty steep ditch. So in my car, it went into like the mud and like the water. Um, it was just like a really hard hit. And I, I swear, I thought my car was just going to be like fucked up. But when they pulled it out, like it wasn't that bad. Like my headlights still work and everything still works. Basically, it's just my radiator's fucked up. So I'm going to have to buy a new one of those and um, it won't be here for like two days. So and then I have to work on it. So it'll probably be like three or four days before I have a car again. So yeah, my dad's gonna take me to Walmart and I'm just gonna get like a bunch of groceries and stuff that I need for the next three or four days because I won't have a car to go anywhere. Luckily, my weed person lives like two blocks over so I can just walk to their house. So yeah, I'll be fine. It's no big deal. Um, it definitely sucks, but it is what it is. You know, like I literally knew I was gonna wreck before I even wrecked because like it was so slick that my car slid down the entire road and I already knew at the end of that road there was like a really steep like bank or like hill and in the middle of it was like a creek and I literally went off of that right into like a huge mud hole and like mud just went like all over my car it was just so intense I'd never been in a wreck before you guys so it was my first wreck you know and um damn it was kind of scary like holy shit it happened so quick like the actual like wrecking part um yeah, y'all, I can't believe that shit happened. Um, and, like, right before I left my house, I was like, hopefully I don't wreck. <laughs> but I did, so here we are. It's all good, though. I'm I'm fine. I didn't get hurt. That's, you know, the most important thing. That's all that matters, so everything's good. Although the cops did show up at, like, the wreck scene, and it was kind of awkward or, like, nerve-wracking. But when I did wreck, y'all, I was, like, going through my car to make sure there was, like, no weed or, like, roaches in there. And luckily, there was, like, no weed or anything. And my car didn't even smell like it, because I've not hotboxed my car and like three days so my car didn't really smell either so I got lucky on that but if there was weed I was gonna literally throw that shit out <laughs> and hide it before the cops came okay you guys so I am finally back home now um my dad took me to Walmart I got hella groceries as y'all can see um because I'm not gonna have a car for like five days now six days so I had to stock up got hella water got hella shit um so I'm about to put all my groceries up you guys and I'm probably gonna make some dinner um, I've not really had anything besides a salad earlier, um, but yeah, damn, it really sucks. I'm not gonna have a car for like five days, but it's all good. Um, we're getting it fixed, and honestly, I don't really care to like sit in my house for like five days and just be stuck here. Honestly, it sounds kind of great. <laughs> um, I have I'm stocked up on weed, I'm stocked up on groceries. I got internet. Fuck it, you know, I'm just gonna chill here and uh, get fucked up <laughs> and eat, and I can make videos. So. It's gonna be a good time. Um, my car's gonna be okay. So yeah, I'm gonna put all these groceries up, you guys. And uh, yeah, I would give y'all a grocery haul, but I'm not feeling grocery haulish. Um, you know what I'm saying? I've been through a lot today. <laughs> like, holy shit. Um, however, I am so excited to have more of these chips because I'm literally obsessed with these, you guys. I was craving them so hard last night. Um, and I was really sad that I didn't have them. So I'm glad I got these now. I should've got two bags. That's how fucking good these are. 
Um, but yeah, I got chicken, some lunch meat, some M&Ms, you already know. The essentials, this shit is fire as fuck. Um, yeah, nothing too crazy, y'all. All right, y'all, it is time to get fucking high. I fucking need this shit. It's been a hell of a day. And um, literally, I cannot wait to get fucking high. So, <laughs> cheers. Hell fucking yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> Y'all needed that. Holy fuck. What a fucking day. It honestly feels really weird being here and not having any car. Like in my driveway, you're like, no way to go anywhere. It's kind of a weird feeling. I'm not used to that. But it's whatever. Y'all, I'm just going to hide out in my house for the next four or five days and hibernate and uh, be a hermit crab, which I'm totally okay with, like I said. Um, since I got groceries and I'm good on weed, so yeah, I'm just going to be chilling, making videos the next few days, y'all. Um, but yeah, for the rest of the day, shit, what time is it? It is 6.12. It's honestly not that late. Um, it felt way later, but I have had a hell of a day, so. <laughs> yeah, y'all, I guess I'm going to now make some dinner. I'm not sure what I'm going to make. I'm probably going to make some pasta. I'll either do chicken or Italian sausage, vegan Italian sausage. So I'm going to do one of those two for dinner tonight. And I got some garlic bread. Oof, it's going to be so fucking good. <laughs> But yeah, y'all, honestly, I thought, like, when I wrecked, I thought my car was going to be fucking totaled. Um, but it's not totaled. It's so, like, when they pulled it out, uh, basically, it just ripped the bumper off at the bottom. So, I'm going to have to buy a new one of those, which is, like, 200 bucks. I'm going to have to buy a new radiator, which is, like, 150 bucks. Um, so, yeah, that's basically all that happened. I swear, though, like, the headlights weren't even fucked. And, y'all, it was a steep-ass hill that I went off of. Like, holy fucking shit. All right, y'all, I got my food cooking. Got my noodles going over here. I got my Italian sausage over here. I'm about to put some uh, pasta sauce in that. I'm about to put my garlic bread in the oven. This is gonna be a fire meal. I make this, I make this meal way too often, but it's just so good. I'm gonna put the prego in the um, skillet. By the way, I found out so many people from my high school are getting pregnant lately, and it's like, what the fuck? Like, so many. Like, I'm not hating either. It's like, do you, but it's like, damn. I'm like doing my best to take care of my cats. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> okay, you guys, so I'm in my room now. I just literally came in here and started inhaling this pasta because I'm, I'm starving and this is so tasty. And I forgot to vlog, so. Mm. Y'all. Shit is so fire. Yeah, y'all, yeah, I was sitting here thinking about the wreck from earlier, and I just think it's so funny how, like, as soon as I wrecked, I didn't even get out to, like, check on my car. I just grabbed my phone and started vlogging, and, like, I went up the hill to get the fucking thumbnail, and I was like, wow. Like, that is so, like, YouTuber of me. <laughs> like, I literally didn't even check to see if my car was okay. Like, not once that entire time. I was just worried about getting my vlog clips in, because I'm dedicated to the vlog. 